is the 4th of February, and this is a must talk. This door was, um, I still have finish on this door inside the grain. Uh, you can see all the polyurethane, urethane, whatever this is, the buildup over here. I have been sanding this door with this grit from here to here, and it's taking me 15 minutes to get there. The rest, you can see what's going on. So this is what happens when your door is uh, maintenance only by polyurethanes or urethanes. See the cracks and the swelling and all this down here? This is petrified, solid. I can't even explain it, but this wood is completely petrified. Pieces up here are hollow versus the pieces down here at the bottom. There's a tone difference. There's a tone difference between the top and the bottom. Yeah, these are completely, and I'm trying to sand off a polyurethane. So let me show you the front door. Walk up here right now. Here's the front door. And I actually have a different stripper for this today. Here's the entryway. And you can see what I did yesterday with a power washer alone. And it did that, and it did nothing else. So I've got some stripper here right now. And across this way, I've got nothing. But over here, you can see how bad this is. But this was done by a urethane, a verethane, whatever it is. It was very hard. And this finish cooked into this doorway. And it cooked into the doors. When you have this entranceway in the middle of the summer, in the middle of Arizona, and all this stone, this heats up to about 150 degrees, I'm pretty doggone sure, against the surfaces. So this just sat here and cooked over the last few years. I'm not sure if I can get this finish off on this door. That's what concerns Steve's touch-up.